darn preferred and own the common and have to pay me that darn dividend. Vic in Florida, Vic! Booyah, Jim. Uh, thanks for being the guiding light for the little retail investor like myself. You know, I was a small, I always like to say this, I was a small investor. How much I would have done to have a show, guy talking stocks, talking to me, uh, you know, make, taking my call. So I am thrilled to help you. Let's go to work together. What do you have? Okay, sticking with the car theme, um, I'm looking at advanced auto parts. I listened to the conference call last week, and in the middle of the conference call, it started pulling back, although uh, they raised full year guidance and they beat, uh, beat the street estimates. Right. What happened there? Well, no, it, look, I mean, you know, remember, we are, it, it, until today, I mean, the market's been terrible. The market's been terrible. The only one that's really holding up, there's two that are holding up. No, no, that's not fair, because O'Reilly's holding up. AutoZone is incredible. That's like the greatest chart ever. That really does look like the north face of Everest. But you know my fave. My fave is Monroe. M-N-R-O. Why? Because that company just keeps delivering and delivering and delivering, giving you a split coming up. Thank you, Brian Ashenberg, for making me stick with it. That is fabulous, and Bob Gross deserves our applause. Frank in Texas. He's the CEO. Frank!